A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. At the time Mary said, My soul magnifies the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God my Savior. For he has looked on the humble estate of his servant. For behold, from now on all generations will call me blessed. For he who is mighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. And his mercy is for those who fear him from generation to generation. He has shown strength with his arm. He has scattered the proud in the thoughts of their hearts. He has brought down the mighty from their thrones and exalted those of humble estate. He has filled the hungry with good things and the rich he has sent away empty. He has helped his servant Israel in remembrance of his mercy. As he spoke to our fathers, to Abraham and his offspring forever. And Mary remained with her about three months and returned to her home. The Gospel of the Lord My soul magnifies the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God my Savior. Praise the Lord! The Magnificat is Mary's most humble yet joyful admission of God's incredible work in her life. and in the life of the people of Israel. Mary rejoices and praises God for whatever was being accomplished in her by God my Savior. At the same time, she recognizes her lowliness and unworthiness to be an object of such great marvels. And she acknowledges that it is the Almighty who has done great things for her. Magnificat is a hymn that heralds the reign of God for a long-suffering people who longed for true freedom. It sings of true victory of poverty over riches and weakness over power. The proud will be humbled and the poor will be exalted the hungry will be filled and the rich will be sent empty away the first will be last and the last will be first the lowly will be lifted up and the enemies will be defeated Mary gives total credit to God for everything even as all generations would call her blessed and finally Mary is aware that it was all because of God's inherent nature of being faithful to his promises who shows mercy to his people My dear sisters and brothers, do I give credit to God and sing His praises for all the blessings in my life? Let us pray. Come, Lord Jesus. Quickly come. You are the King of all creation. We sing your praises with Mary. for all the blessings in our lives particularly for the surpassing gift of knowing Christ Jesus our lord and following him save the human kind from the slavery of sin disease and the present pandemic poverty fear and anxiety 
send your Holy Spirit and renew the face of the earth as we prepare to welcome you on Christmas Day. Amen.